this is the sagittal section of the face in the sagittal section of the face the first thing that we are going to see is the lateral wall of the nose this is the lateral wall of the nose it has superior concha middle concha and the inferior concha the superior and the middle concha are part of the ethmoidal labyrinth the space under the middle concha is known as the middle meatus it has the ethmoidal bulla or and the hiatus semilunaris the uh, bulla ethmoidalis has middle uh, ethmoidal air sinuses the hiatus semilunaris is a crescentric between the bulla ethmoidalis above and the uncinate process of the ethmoid bone below immediately below the bulla we have the hiatus semilunaris which has opening for the maxillary sinus then we have the ethmoidal infundibulum that extend upward from the anterior part of the hiatus and the wall of the uh, infundibulum receives the anterior ethmoidal sinuses the frontal air sinuses opens on the summit of the infundibulum directly or by the frontonasal duct the uh, anterior part of the middle meatus it continues with a depression known as the atrium this is the atrium which lies above the vestibule of the nose this is vestibule of the nose and it lies above the uh, the above area is known as the atrium it is limited above by the agar nasi this is agar nasi now when we talk about the superior concha the superior concha extends anterior posteriorly above the posterior half of the middle concha this is middle concha it extends above the posterior half of the middle concha the space under the cover of the superior concha is known as the superior meatus into which the posterior ethmoidal sinuses open uh, this is our inferior concha below the inferior concha we have the inferior uh, meatus in the inferior meatus we receive the opening of the termination of the nasolacrimal duct next we talk about the palate we have hard palate and soft palate the hard palate is formed by the palatine process of the maxilla and the horizontal part of the palatine bone Uh, then we have next is the soft palate soft palate is a mucus covered fibromuscular glandular curtain which hangs from the posterior margin of the hard palate the lower border is free and it presents a conical projection called the uvula next we talk about the pharynx so pharynx is divided into three parts the uh, nasopharynx the oropharynx and the laryngopharynx The nasopharynx is also known as the epipharynx. It has a pharyngeal opening for the auditory tube. This is the pharyngeal opening for the auditory tube. The auditory tube is a mucus lined osseo cartilaginous tube which is about 36 mm long and it uh, communicates the lateral wall of the nasopharynx and the anterior wall of the tympanic cavity. now uh, the nasopharynx communicates with the oropharynx through the the nasopharynx communicates with the oropharynx through the uh, pharyngeal isthmus which has a soft palate in front and the passivent ridge ridge behind this is passivent ridge which is behind the pharyngeal isthmus and this is the soft palate which is present in front of the pharyngeal isthmus now this tubal elevation in the nasopharynx it's it guards the upper posterior and the upper margin of the auditory tube opening it has two mucus fold that extends from it the first mucus fold is the salpingo palatine fold this is salpingo palatine fold and the next fold is the salpingo pharyngeal fold next we have is the pharyngeal recess or the fossa of rosenmuller so behind the tubal elevation the space is known as the fossa of rosenmuller or the pharyngeal recess coming on to the oropharynx oropharynx is also known as the mesopharynx it lies behind the oral cavity and it supported dorsally by the bodies of the c2 and the c3 vertebrae uh, in front the oropharynx communicates with the oral cavity through the oropharyngeal isthmus this is the oropharyngeal isthmus it is bounded above by the soft palate below by the dorsal uh, part of dorsal, dorsal surface of the posterior third of the tongue below it communicates with the larynx at the level of the upper border of the epiglottis this is the up, this is our epiglottis this is the upper part of the epiglottis next we have the laryngopharynx 
द लेरिंगो फेरिंग्स इज ऑल्सो नोन एज दी हाइपो फेरिंग्स एंड इट स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द अपर बॉर्डर ऑफ द एपिग्लॉटिस नेक्स्ट वी हैव इज आर टंग द बल्क ऑफ द टंग इज फॉर्म बाई जीनियो ग्लॉसिस मसल दिस इज आर जीनियो ग्लॉसिस मसल सो इन टंग वी हैव टू टाइप्स ऑफ मसल द एक्सट्रेंसिक मसल एंड द इंट्रेंसिक मसल द बल्क इज फॉर्म बाय द जीनियो ग्लॉसिस विच इज द एक्सट्रेंसिक मसल द एक्सट्रेंसिक मसल ऑल्टर द पोजिशन ऑफ द टंग नेक्स्ट वी हैव द साइनसिस दिस वन इज आर स्पिनोइडल साइनस दिस वन ओवर हियर इज आर फ्रंटल साइनस 